Okay, I'm gonna walk you through a quick demo of how to connect an Eden monitor to your network with a hard wire. So even if your Eden network, or excuse me, Eden monitor does not have a Wi-Fi module, uh, you, most of them have a network port in the back. So you should be able to still hook it up to your network with a cable. And that's actually quite a bit simpler than the Wi-Fi version. So all you do, it's very similar, you hit menu, uh, you hit maintenance, and then here you select user maintain. And these are password protected for some reason. Uh, it's always just A, B, C though. So you go A, B, C. And at this point, um, actually I think you might be able to change the password, but the default is A, B, C. Um, at this point, we're gonna go to network maintain. And here, if you have uh, the Wi-Fi module in yours, there will be Wi-Fi as an option. That's what I'm currently using here, but I'm gonna switch it to wired. And then I'm gonna hit config. Um, and as we just want this to be set to dynamic. So we don't want it to uh, pick, just be a hard-coded IP address. We wanna leave it on dynamic so that it finds one on your network that is not uh, already taken. This should be the default, but if it's not, uh, just hit config and make sure it sets dynamic there. So again, that's just right next to the wired. Uh, you hit config and then dynamic. Um, not static. They're static. We're going to leave it on dynamic. And really, that's it. Uh, you actually have to just plug it in. So uh, get a cable. Here I have, this one is a Cat5e uh, variety little cable. Um, there's just a network port here in the back. There's only one. And I just plug it in. And then this is just a little Wi-Fi access point that I have here on this particular network. But um, we just plug it into the network port here. There's one for like internet coming in and then one that's got this little symbol here. This will vary depending on your router. You might have these wired to your walls, whatever. But um, generally speaking, just look for the network port, plug it in, and really that should be it. You should see a little light start blinking here if it's actually communicating at all uh, with something else. And one thing I wanna point out is here on the front, so even though we are connected to the network here, it still says this little symbol right here has a red X in it. That makes it look like it's not connected, but don't be fooled. Um, I think that symbol is purely for uh, whether or not it's successfully talking to the Eden central monitoring software that they make available. But uh, in this case, we're not using that, so it's not gonna look like it's connected, but as long as it's wired, uh, you configure it and to be dynamic, you should be good to go. All right. Oh, to close out quickly, instead of hitting XXX, you can just hit menu down here and you're all set.